What is Lumber Liquidators doing today, my friend? Well, there's a delay in the opening of trading. It has not yet begun to trade. It's already 10.55. Uh, what we do know is that it is expected to be a big loser once trading does begin because in the pre-market, Lumber Liquidators tumbled to under $39. So that's a pretty good indication right there, off 25%. Uh, 38.91 was the latest price. Now, as you mentioned, 60 Minutes ran that story last night that showed the company sold illegal flooring. The company, of course, has responded by saying that they comply with applicable regulations regarding their products and as well in California, which is the most stringent. They also make the point that these attacks are driven by a small group of short-selling investors. If you look at the short interest in this company, 33% of float, which is shares available for trading, that is up from about 11% in July. So certainly the bears have uh, gotten a lot more active when it comes to lumber liquidators of late. Uh, one thing that we should mention here is that the stock has already tumbled quite a bit uh, last week, down 24%, going from $68 to almost $52, after the CEO had already indicated that an upcoming 60-minute story would put the company in an unfavorable light. David Strasser says this is a bad accusation that will probably hurt sales momentum. It could shave 10 to $0.13 cents off earnings per share, but it's already reflected, he says, in today's opening price of about $40.